This 13 millimeter 1.4 lens from Viltrox is absolutely amazing. You gotta just press record. Hey, what's up? It's Omar Takori with Think Media, and this channel is all about helping you build your influence with online video and YouTube, and we do that by sharing the best tips and tools on how to do so, like talking about cameras and lenses, as well as YouTube strategy, so if you're interested in that, be sure to subscribe. Now, this lens is just absolutely amazing, like I said. Currently, it is $429 at the time of shooting this video here in the US, and it is currently offered for Nikon Z mount, Sony E mount, and Fuji cameras as well. They don't really offer it for Canon cameras quite yet, but I believe they probably will eventually as they have other lenses offered for Canon EFM mount. Now I'm gonna put this lens on my Nikon camera because that's what I have it for. But what I'm currently using right now is the Sigma 16 millimeter 1.4 lens. This lens is $350 and this would be the goaded or greatest of all time YouTube lens for specifically talking head video because when you're about arm's length distance from the camera or in this case, just to give you a uh, measurement, I am 20, six inches away from the camera, it gives you a nice medium wide shot. Now with Viltrox offering this 13 millimeter lens, might as well, let me just put it on real quick and let's do that real quick. Whoa, look how much more of a wider shot this lens gives the camera. Isn't that crazy? That I didn't even move, but it seems like I'm so much further away and there's just so much more going on. And this is really cool because a lot of people need a wider lens, but having that 1.4 aperture to give you that blurry background, although it's wide, is super clutch. Now there's a few reasons why I would say you'd want this 13 millimeter lens as opposed to the Sigma 16 millimeter lens. And the first one is the space you're filming in. If you are filming in a smaller space, then having a wider lens is gonna make your room look a little bit bigger, but also allow you to get a little bit closer to the camera and still look like you're further away. Like I'm, I haven't changed distances, still 26 inches, but now I can come a little bit closer and it'll still be kind of like the same look as the Sigma millimeter lens. The second reason is audio. You know, I like to boom my audio. So right now I have a boom mic just right outside of the frame, but you know, you could put a mic on top of this camera and then you can get close enough to it to capture good audio so that you don't actually have to get a boom set up and things like that. So that's one good reason. Another good reason is stabilization. A lot of cameras, when you kick on a digital stabilization mode, then it actually crops in a little bit. So, you know, if you're trying to get the Sigma 16 millimeter lens to vlog with, and then you crop in, it's gonna be a little bit too tight. Having the 13 millimeters as margin, so when that crop does happen, you still have a fairly wide shot to vlog with, so that's super nice. But what's also cool about this lens is that there's an aperture ring. So if you like to manually adjust your aperture, if you like to keep your camera settings for video locked in like I do, like I like keeping my ISO fairly at 100 or as low as possible, my shutter speed at 50, but then in any other lighting condition, I will adjust my aperture and just having it on the lens is super nice. But you could totally set the ring to the A so that you can control your aperture with your actual camera. And so Viltrox definitely didn't cut any corners when making this lens and for whatever it's worth, they include a lens hood and obviously your lens cap, but everything is just high quality. Like this isn't like cheap plastic. I feel like this is like metal or something, but all that to say, sick lens. We'll post links down to everything in the description below. If you wanna check out another video on best lenses for vlogging and YouTube, you can click or tap the screen. Can't wait to see you in a future video. Peace.